we're gonna be looking at like all my collection cards that I've collected over the years and we'll start off with my baseball card binder well it's not really baseball cards it's like sports cards but like basically the same thing all right oh I remember this um I got it on, let me get let me get these three cards out four actually Uh, and if you're new to this channel, hit that subscribe button, uh, join our team, and, um, yeah. Okay, so basically, this was, like, one of my favorite players on the Capitals. It's a hockey uh, NHL team. He was one of my favorite, probably, like, my second favorite, and I've had this card for a while. As you can see, that little crack right there. Um, so I went to this blast camp a couple years ago, like a summer camp. And and the players, like these, him, him, and him, they were all like the coaches for the camp. And, and then last day, they let us sign stuff, and my mom let me get these cards. That's his name. Yeah. So. And just the back of that one and it just says like how tall they are where they're from and let's go so I, I live in like Maryland so like my home baseball team is the Baltimore Orioles so I have a lot of Orioles in there on the first page JJ Hardy oh, hold on where is Where is he? Where is he? Where is he? Oh, there he is. There he is. What? Three of them. One. Two. Three. So this is my favorite player on the Orioles. He doesn't play for the Orioles anymore. I don't even know what team he plays for. Manny Machado. Um, I can Yeah, sixty eight home runs. Yeah. And that card. Oh, oh, that card. <clears throat> yeah, so and then I, I have people from Seattle. Yeah, I don't know. I have a bunch of people like together based on what team they play like this is a whole page for the Yankees Blue Yankees um Blue Jays Colorado Rockies <clears throat> I'm just gonna skip through all my baseball cards and go straight to the football cards so I didn't know that let me but I, I just used to collect sports cards just because I thought they were, like, cool. I didn't really know many of the players, especially with football cards. I didn't realize I had Stefan Diggs until. And this is also when he was on the Vikings. I was from 2019, I think. Yes, yeah, so I didn't know I had um, Diggs.
Jimmy Watkins. Yeah, I got a lot of people that like TJ Watt. I have two Dan Marinos. Antonio Brown. Waller. And then I have Fortnite cards. <clears throat> so I got like pickaxes right there. I got what's that skin called? I don't even know. And I'll take assassin knockoffs. And then we have the team that these guys played for. The bottom are blast. One of the coaches, I don't think. I'm pretty sure. And then I only have these three soccer. Actually, no. I have five soccer cards. My God, they're just under this binder. And I have two more. Um, Neymar and Kristen and Kristen Pulisic. So, yeah, they're my only like soccer cards, like not from the whole team. Um, oh my god, my throat. Yeah, I'm, I'm sick. I'm sick right now. That's why I sound a little bit weird. <clears throat> Uh, now we have my hockey cards. Nicholas Backstrom plays for the Caps. And then that's all my like sports cards. I I would guess. Yeah, I guess sports cards. Now we can go to my other stuff like my Pokemon and yeah, that all that. And now that we're finished with all like sports cards, we're gonna pick them out. I'm just gonna start off with these four, with these four, because they're like the first cards I could I can get. So I got this Alone Executor V. It's a big card compared to a normal card. Um, actually, if you, I have a video that. That actually opened up this box, and I uh, you you're gonna go wanna click that video after this, and you're gonna see what I pull because I got some pretty good stuff. Me and my stepbrother Casey, and then I got this. This is this is my first like big promo card actually. Like I got this. This is from my first box. We got the I got the Pikachu V Union from my grandma, and I got Metal Charizard from it. Oh, actually, I also have that video, too, so go check that out. I got this card for my birthday. I got the Your Shurfu V-Box. Um, got some pretty good stuff from that. I didn't make a video on that just because of my birthday. I'm like, yeah. Um, and then moving along, I got the Shining Fates Pikachu V promo card. Uh, I got this. Didn't make a video on it just because, like, yeah, like whatever and i when i opened that i got a couple shiny from it you know <laughs> all right so i got this for my birthday for my grandma I got shining fates elite trainer box I already opened it i used to store some stuff and i'll show you i'll show you what i store in it one stack of energy two stack of energy three stack of energy mega colossal stack of energy so what's that so basically what out earlier today i was seeing how many of these little tiny energies does it take to make this big one it actually takes three of them see so like it takes three of them so this this one thing this one thing is equal to six energies six of these so i basically have six of them uh, i got a couple hard hard cases only because um i used a bunch of them on like my rarest cards so and then i have my astral radiance sleeves that i have used they're the only ones i actually used 
Brilliant star sleeves, haven't used them. Shiny face sleeves, haven't used them. And then, trainer toolkit sleeves. Uh, these ones are actually pretty good. I like that they have like a purple and black Pokeball on it. Mm. <coughs> I'll show you what I have in my other trainer boxes. Uh, let's do brilliant stars. Okay, in my brilliant stars, I have nothing in it. <laughs> um, I didn't make a video when I got this one or that one, but I did when I got the Astro Radiant one, which was actually the same video as when I got the Executor V box. I think it was the same video, it might have been a different video. But I still made this into a video. And in this one, uh, I just have all the dice and stuff from my e from my other ETVs. I just dropped them all in here. Like, turn this to get Astro Radiant. Astro Radiant. Trying to face. And then all my poison that. And, um, just the dividers. Oh, yeah, and, and, damn, the playbooks. These. Because I don't know how to battle. Don't judge me. I don't know how to battle. Um, yeah. So if I ever want to battle, I'm just going to use that. <laughs> okay. Got this Dragonite V. Um, V Star box from Pokemon Go thing. My video just cut for some reason. I might click something. Uh, anyways, I just store my big cards in here because they're the, actually the only thing that I actually fit in there. Got my Pokeball that has <clears throat> nothing in it. I just use it for a display. If I ever make a deck, I'll put it in here. And I just put it on this like floating shelf over my bed that we installed. Okay, going on to like the better stuff. I'll start with the smallest. The smallest thing I got. If it's not if any of my cards. What well, this is my card, but I this is just my little tiny stack of all my evolutions that I've that I've got. So I got Clefairy Hollow, Charmeleon Reverse, Charmeleon non hollow, non hollow, Charmander, Professor's Oak, Hand Metapod, Weedle, Tangula. Cancuna, Nidorino, Coughing, Nidoran, Seal, Poliwag, Vulpix, Fire Energy, um, Ponyta, De-Evolution Spray, Onyx, Nidoran, Coughing, Staria. That's all my evolutions, but like, if I were to ever get this hollow graded, I don't think it's going to come back too good because just that and it's got whiting all over the back. Because I think I actually, oh look, and right here it's starting to peel right there. I mean, it's still a cool card and all that. Um, This one actually, this one actually looks pretty good. Uh, it's just a reverse hollow. I'm not going to go over all the cards. Um, yeah. I just keep them in this thing that I randomly got. Um, and oh, this is where every evolution card that I own goes right there. Okay, um, I guess we can go on the binder now. Alright, so this is my binder. Um, it's nothing too special about it besides I got stickers on it. 
that I got from my local card shop. Oh, yeah. Um, nothing special about it. The stickers. I got them on both sides. I'll show you guys. I remember. And I can get the zip in, and it zips. Like that. So. Okay, on the first page, I know you're going to yell at me in the comments. This is a fake card. Okay. Just gonna go back. Plus, we, we all know Pokemon doesn't make gold cards like this. And there's no such thing as a Charmion, Charizard, and Charmander. GX. Especially gold. So. Um. I got Psyduck, Charm Charmander, Charmeleon, and then I got myself two. Wait, what? Three? Just when I put. I got three. Uh, Charizard's in here. Um, I actually did pull one of these. It's on my channel in this in a video. I think is when I got the uh, Executor box. I did pull a Charizard. I'm pretty sure. I don't remember. And you're gonna wanna see our reaction. Yes, I got that. And then I got Score Bunny, Raboot, and a Cinderace. And can't forget Psyduck. I got Sil Speed and I got Santa Scorch, Luria and Lucario, Bulbasaur, Ivysaur, Venusaur, Squirtle, War Turtle, and Blastoise, Eevee, Leafeon. Leafeon GX. I know it's fake. I know. I know. I just use it until I get a real leaf on GX. Leaf on GX. Um, Ridiki, Corvus Squire, and then Corviknight right there. Corviknight's actually one of my favorite cards. And I'm going to take these out because I can only fit so many with the certain amount of pages I got. Um, trainers, you know. This one of the older ones. Um, yeah, I'm just gonna kind of go through these quickly because. Oh look, uh, I got a couple of uh, these tins, Pokemon Go tins. You know, Pika. Uh, yeah, I'm just gonna start going through. I did get a couple of Ditto. Lugia, one of my favorites, too. Snorlax. Oh, comment and put down in the comments what your favorite card, what your favorite Pokemon card is, and, or what your favorite card in my whole collection of cards, what, you, what your favorite card is. And if there's any cards you would like, not that I'm going to be able to, not that I'm going to be able to send them to you. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay, whatever. That was just my Pokeball falling on top of something. Nothing broke. We good. Okay, so I'm going to close that up. Now I, now I have more space. Let me move them. Move that. Move that. Okay. Mm. Mm. Okay. So we're gonna go with my first ever tin I ever got. Uh, shout out to my dad. He let me get this at Target when we went one time. Um. So basically, what I got in here, I just got like a big thing of sleeves big bag of sleeves you know what i'm saying um this is a custom sleeve that i made i know nothing looks custom about it but <laughs> so what i did was i took off one of my binder pages i started cutting them in the sleeve i only made a couple of them and then i bought and then i got new sleeves so that's the story of that um, I got a couple mini binders. 
or not, not many binders, many tens. This one has my coins in them. Um, oh wait, I forgot I have a, like a pen in here. So I got this Lucario coin that I traded my friend for a pack of Sour Patch Kids. <laughs> the, the limited edition McDon McDonald's Pikachu coin. Uh, this is a nice coin. I really like this one. It's pretty basic, though. Oh, did put a film. <laughs> um, Moltres pin. Yeah. And then I have a lot of the same coins. Pikachu. Another Pikachu. Charizard. I actually love these Charizard ones. I think they're really good artwork. Charizard and another Pikachu. And then I just keep them in here since I have a couple mini binders. It's kind of like... Yeah, I'll just put them. And I'm actually able to fit, I fit like two or three mini binders in here. My other one isn't in here right now because I'm using it for something. And I put the sleeves in there. Um, let me go. Let me get, uh, let's just, let's do my mini binder now. It has like my ultra rares and all that. Okay, starting off. Uh, if you didn't watch my video, one of my other videos, I got the Pikachu V Union box. This is basically what it is. Like it, there's a there's four other of these cards in here, and then they make, um, and then they make this, just not as big. Actually, it might be the same size, but I don't know because the cards are cut. They're not like cut, but like cut shorter than that. Pikachu V. Pikachu EX, pretty bad conditions. Um, <laughs> um, 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 yes, yeah, think bad conditions. And <laughs> probably one of my first or my first ultra rare that I got. Um, my friend gave it to me at his birthday party when I went to his house. And I got my V Maxes here, E V V Max, Selby V Max. Actually, Selby V Max and Corbinite V Max. I think they're like my first two V Maxes I ever got. Traded my little my stepbrother for that. Another. And one an executor. Executor full art. Another executor. I got three of them. And I actually got that from the executor box. Um Hound Doom trainer card that's a pretty good card actually whoa actually i like that okay um ex i don't have many exes but i like exes flanks trainer card obama snow trainer card greninja v one of my favorites lapras v probably another one of my favorites moltres v um yeah we got that one we got Justin Beaver. Justin Beaver right there. Oh, 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 yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Hold on. Let me just grab that card out. One of my 100% all-time favorite cards, bro. Literally, um, when I got the V Union box from the Celebrations uh, Pikachu V Union box, this, this is one of the cards I pulled from it. I don't think it's worth much because when I checked the price, it was only worth like a dollar. But like, it, it's just such a cool card, you know? So let me put that back in. <clears throat> um, pulled that off of a single pack of, um, that was, that was really good luck. I got that off my Brilliant Stars Elite Trainer Box. Uh, Japanese card. Oh, I only got one of them. Yeah, Dragonite. I got, I, I have such good luck pulling Dragonite. But, I mean, I guess it's okay for Charizards. But, like, for any other card, like a Blastoise or Venus, so I haven't pulled. I've only pulled, like, two of them. <sighs> um... And I also traded a couple of Dragonites, so, like, I have less uh, V-Star from, actually, that V-Star box. Got a 
this box, the Deoxys box. Oh, this is what I like this card too. Urshu Fruit, Single Strike Urshu Fruit, V Max Trainer card. It's a good one. Single Striker Urshu Fruit. And then we got another Urshu Fruit. And then I got the more Pico V Union. Blastoise trade in my stepbrother that. And then I got the three Blastoise Venusaur. And a fourth Charizard. Yep. Yeah. Uh, so this is just my mini binder. Um, this is my mini binder. Um, I do have more. Let's go look at that. Ugh. Okay, another mini tin. You might think uh, there's probably nothing that good in there. If it's one of the last ones, it's gonna have stuff, good stuff in it, and you're gonna be like, "Oh yeah, that's fake! Oh my god, there's so many fake cards! There's so many fake cards!" The thing about these fake cards, these are gonna be actually people are gonna want them. Oh, yeah, I, um. This is an Espeon I colored Pikachu. <laughs> so basically what, what I do to these fake cards is I customize them or I just trace over them so I can get better at drawing. I made the Espeon water and fire. Didn't make the front look so good. I haven't finished the front, I gotta do its eyes. Um, Pikachu, didn't customize the back of that yet. The McHugh and Gengar. Didn't customize the back. This one is not mine. I wish it was though. <laughs> um, I made it for my friend, but then the day I was gonna give it to him, I had to leave home. I had to leave school early because I got because I was sick. His name is Raymond, but he said just Ray. But he gave me this Charizard V Max to customize. Lightning and Leaf. Uh, this is my first one I customized. And then I, <laughs> I started doing multiple, and then I did this. Uh, this one actually one of my favorites because I did the fire back too. And then my stepbrother made this for me. And then, oh, I got to give this to someone too. Yeah. But I will be, actually, I think I didn't, I made a short. Yeah, that's what I made. I made a short. Uh, I don't know which one I customized. I think it yeah, it's this one. I customized this one. Got 2,000 views. That's good. But we can get better. I just know we can. So, anyways. So, um, I traded it. I made one that looked like an angry Pop-Tart. Not trying to make it look like an angry Pop-Tart. But it just turned out like that. And I traded that and another custom card for 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 20. what the heck, wait, what, 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 what was I doing, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, Four, twenty-five. Okay, I wasn't hallucinating. I thought I was. He only said seventeen. I guess I just had some. Yeah, I did just have some, but like that's a lot just for two custom cards. I mean, like in these custom cards, they take time depending on what you do. Um, let's look at my next ones. And for the grand finale, we got my Pokemon Go ten. It has another mini tin and some others that we will be getting to. So in this mini tin, uh, it's just because I traded. I just traded my school, so I just put a bunch of cards that I don't really want and want to trade. Uh, I probably might keep that. I like trainers, so I might actually put that away. Um, and I, I like these are the ones I'll be willing to trade any day for anything, but. This is my this is my first um uh trainer full art trainer. Oh, this is I I, lo I love this card. 
but I got some better ones. Just, just wait, just wait, just wait. Okay, so in here, um, it's just a bunch of gold cards, just cause like I'm fancy like that. So I got a bunch of these. They're all fake though. I don't care that they're fake. They're still gold cards, and I think they look good. Um. <laughs> Now we're getting to the good stuff. You ready? <laughs> I don't think you're ready. <laughs> and here's why. <laughs> Boom. Radiant Charizard. Radiant Charizard. Bro, when I pulled this, I was running around the whole house screaming, oh my god, I got a Radiant Charizard. Luckily, I put the card down <laughs> and I didn't damage it. Um... Yeah, I got them also on these hard cases. Like, they're my best cards. They're in my hard cases. I want to get it graded, but I don't really know how to grade cards. But, yeah. And I pulled this on my birthday, so I wasn't recording when I pulled it. Which, I'm... <clears throat> so, then I traded... I got this Charizard V. First edition. This is my first ever first edition. It's from uh, Jungle. Goldine. Um, Japanese. This is actually a pocket monster. Uh, let me. Mm. Yeah, if I'm correct, I think this is the pocket monster. Yep, yeah, this is the pocket monster that I got. Um, it's a hollow, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Yes, yeah, a hollow. Um, not good conditions. It doesn't have good conditions at all, but, um, it's fine, because it's still, I'm just happy I have my hands on some old school cards. I can actually get this back. Alright, back to it. Uh, Mega Blastoise EX. This card is actually pretty expensive. It's like 70 bucks. Um, and then all my favorite cards, my shinies. Pulled that on my birthday. Pulled that on my birthday. Pulled that with the Pikachu Shining Page thing. Birthday. Pikachu thing. Trade it. Traded. Traded. Pulled. Uh, I got this box. I think that that came with the Moltres pin. And then I got a Spark Rainbow Rare. Yes, sir, you know it. Um, if you remember the video, this is the Metal Charizard. Zekrom from the Brilliant Stars Elite Trainer box. I love this trainer trainer um card because it just looks so like chillax like so this has got that like little rainbow background in the sky so uh, yeah and then flying pikachu v and surfing pikachu v that's how it ends us off um hope you enjoyed if you did consider hitting that subscribe button it's always been my dream to hit it to get myself a play button i've made myself a play button haven't actually got one before haven't even seen one before. Um, but tell me what you think in the comments. See you in the next one. Bye.